Hey guys, it's me, Kilo One and One and Six, and I wanna do a uh, Modern Warfare Three commentary. Now Black Ops, which feels really, really good, not having more noob tubes or more ghost users bothering us. So now Modern Warfare Three, my thoughts on it. If you guys should get it or not. First, I wanna say, uh, what well, late Happy Thanksgiving. Or, um, yeah, they happy to see me, uh, this game, you know, I'm getting off traffic, this game is, uh, really, really good, the, the guns are really, really beast, um, you s the map, the only thing I didn't like is the map, the map's because I'm a Russian kind of guy, that's why I'm using the PS90 with a UAV, um, Predator and a Reaper, and, uh, my first time ever using the Reaper and I didn't like it at all. Maybe you guys like it, well I didn't. Yeah. If it's your first time, I will not recommend using it because it's crap. I'm serious. I mean, you guys like it, but I don't. I don't know. Okay, the guns are amazing. <clears throat> the perks. The proficiencies, which I really like a lot. Now you can remove cake. Adding some extra stuff to make the gun really good in every map. Um, the kill streaks they change a little bit. Uh, the um, the pay flow is not, it's not a nine kill streak anymore. It's a twelve. Well, it's the only downside, but it doesn't matter. And uh, there's a MOAB, same mortar, like in Black Ops, but uh, it actually ends the game. It's like a nuke, which is really good. They brought the they brought it back. I'm really happy. And uh, I also like the Juggernaut kill streak and the uh, strike packages. The strike packages pretty much if you're not like a, if you're a team kind of person and aren't that um good, as I guess you can say, yeah. Even if you die and you have the support package, uh, you can the kill streak is still um goes on. So even if you die, you can still help your team out. The strike, the support. Package, uh, package brings like a uh, UAV, ballistic bed, sand turret, uh, stealth bomber, which is really surprising. It brings stealth bomber, uh, and another juggernaut, and uh, I don't know, but it's a uh, oh, recon drone and a lot of more stuff, which is really, really good. Uh, there's also a specialist, where uh, if you're not the kill stick kind of guy, you just want to be a super soldier, like a long gun. Every two kills you get, you get uh, you get perks depending on what you want. So that's really good if you like marathon. If you like a slight, slide of hand and uh, let's see, uh, stalker, sit rep, whatever you guys want. Uh, you get you keep progressing, you keep getting more um, points, and also you get um, you keep getting points and you level up super fast. And you're gonna be like a super soldier when you have when you get eight kills, which is really really good. Um, one thing I don't like uh, is um the death streak. It's because the, now there's a dead man's hand, and what that pretty much does is uh when you die like four times or five, I don't really know. You you have like a C4 shot to your body, and uh you just press press it as soon as you die, and as soon as you die, and you kill everyone. The the person who killed you, you killed him. So that's the only bad side. Uh, there's no noob tubes, but it's still there's no people using it. But there's still grenade launchers. Um, let me see what else. Uh, other than that, uh, uh, the game has more positives than negatives. I would recommend it more if you just want to have fun and not get frustrated. I would recommend them more the Battlefield. Both are really, really great games. I don't want to start. I don't want to start a game war. They're both really awesome games. I played the demo or the Battlefield demo. It's just really amazing. But I like having fun in games, and that's what I pretty much did. I don't like realistic stuff like Battlefield. I like going rushing using fake, fake ass, huge uh, streaks, and you owning noobs, owning campers, and that's what. I'm that's what pretty much COD is, and I love that. That's why I even still made this channel, just to bring out what I love to do. And have some fun doing it. So, yeah, I would recommend it more than Battlefield if you're uh, kind of like a gamer like me. So, this game is really, really good. 
I will strongly recommend it. Um, yeah, and I don't think it's gonna go down in like to like 2012. So just get it, play with your friends, and it gives you a variety of choices. So yeah, guys, that's it, and peace out.